Hi, welcome to the new video. Um, today I'm doing the uh, Tony Montana's car phrase. Um, black and white, as always, are uh, opaque colors, the rest are transparent colors. I already prepared the uh, painting surface, which is a Chromalux uh, paper. So I lay down the positive uh, outline of the, the main character and I did the other half in white. So now I'm using the first stencil with full black. So now comes the second stencil um, and it's just the part around the eyes. So they are using dark grey. And this is stencil for the mouth and the eye color. Because I'm doing a black and white piece, I don't need this. Just to do like a little bit of shading for the mouth. So now comes grey number two, which is a middle tone. I'm just doing it now in the video the light version I have uh, uh, redone the picture after the painting and uh, made um, everything in the face darker. You can see this on the right side. So that's what you always can do is can reapply the stencil and make things darker. But it's mostly better to you start with a light um, light grey so once you have you're going too dark you can't go back that easily but you always can reapply the stencils and make it darker so this is now the first white Which is like um, fifty percent um, opacity, and now this is the cover-up stencil, and there I have like the full white uh, eye reflection, and now I'm doing the the little uh, picture with the machine gun. This is the first black. And now I'm doing the grey. Again, um, here start light with the grey. You can always do things darker. So, and then I have um, two stencils with white, like with the big portrait, I have the full white in the cover stencil. First I'm doing um, a little shadow, just using the negative stencil. Now I'm doing the white. So full white in there.
and then was less a Pekasi. The second white. And now I'm putting back on the cover stencil and I'm doing the blood splatter. So this is a nicely detailed stencil. So first I'm painting um, the white underground for all the stuff that's on the black. If you want like a shadow on the white side, you can, you could um, use this stencil, um, paint it grey, then reapply the stencil a few millimeters to one side, make it white and red, and then you have like a nice shadow line. So I'm doing this. The other side of the head. Do white first and then do red again. And then you can put it on the other side. Two. No need for putting white down. again I'm doing some freehand blood splatter You also can use some skin colors, for example, as you can see on the right side, as I have done a rework on the picture to make it darker. And I'm doing another blood splatter. Just remember to flip the stencil around so you don't have the same pattern over and over again. So. Just move it a little bit. I'm adding some shadow lines with the grey. And I'm doing the breast, uh, the chest hair. A little bit more. And also with white. And I'm doing like a little aura around the, the head. So I'm just going around the the head to make like shine behind the, the head. So that's a picture. If you like it, you can subscribe my channel. Over 700 videos there. See you soon.